Hello, my friends. My name is Ed DaCosta, and you have found the Get Edified video blog, and I am so delighted that you're here. Now, you could be watching this video at any time of the year, but it is the first part of January, and of course, that's a time every year closely associated with goal setting, New Year's resolutions, and whatnot. So I wanted to share with you my perspective on really what drives goal achievement. Not so much goal setting, and it's not the answer to what do you want, but it's really about the why you want it. Now, when I talk to people, and again, a coach asks provocative questions, I ask them what it is they want to achieve. There's the what. Then I ask them why. Why is it? And I want you to dig deep. I want you to go underneath the surface. If you say you want a new car, well, don't just say it's because your, your existing car is is old or you know is not reliable. I get that. That's a legitimate answer, but it doesn't speak to the depths of human desire and the whys that drive us to uh, pursue our goals with not only great vigor, but with great endurance. That means not give up like most people do on all of their New Year's resolutions or poorly thought out goals. And, and again, John Maxwell, he talks about the difference between success and significance, truly making a difference in the lives of other people. So what are, what are the whys behind the things that we want to achieve? We want a new job, a better relationship. We want some monetary or financial goal. Those are wonderful, but connect deeply with the why. What, what are the, the drivers behind those desires? For most people, they are what? They are connectedness, love. Again, the word significance or a sense of fulfillment. It's, um, for many people, it's safety and security. So start with those base human needs that we have, that you have, and then build your goals from those elements, those foundational elements of what human desires are. So, you know, ask yourself, when do you feel most fulfilled? When do you feel most connected? When do you feel like you are loved or you're able to share love? Truly start with those and then use those as the building blocks for the goals that you set for your intellectual development, your spiritual development, your physical fitness, your, again, your financial goals as well. Those, all the what's are fine, but they are really more achievable, more attainable when you begin with why. Again, my name is Ed DaCosta, and I hope you found this video helpful. Wherever you are in this great, big, beautiful world of ours, make it a great day.